So are you making one? I always make whatever I do for competitions. That looks really sweet. Not gay. Not a gay type of sweet, but a sweet kind of sweet. I'm saving all the junk and then I'm gonna, I don't know, I'll pop down a duplicate of it and see how it works. So we're no starting to go. On it yet, just the port. That's probably how big I'm gonna have mine. Well, he wants you to make it reach up like 20 feet and stuff. Mm -hmm. So the last one's like 30 feet. Look, the things at Costco, the big racks at Costco are how high on the very top? No one's been to Costco? They're probably 24 or 25 feet at the top. So I'm asking for that sort of lifting. I'm asking for slightly longer than that because this is Gary's month. And if you don't go slightly longer than what you could do it. I don't remember where everything is, jeez. No, it's so all the, the prop spawns have all been moved. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to spend like three hours rearranging them. I need like four categories to spawn from, and that's it. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys prop protection so you can like move around my junk. <laughs> Throwing it into the void. Don't give Adobe prop protection until you're absolutely sure he knows what he's doing. <laughs> he occasionally breaks everything. Well, let me see if I the two things. Go. Oh, but then I also have some cool ideas. So you're forced lean back? The forks didn't have the rack yet, but this uh, rack, I will have it accessed, and maybe some hydraulics from the top to the back of the well, I was... I fell off, and then hit my spray and no cook key at the same time. Um, Kitty won't shut up? I have Wheezy no doodle. idea how to use the prop protection on this. Oh, hey, hey. Cheats aren't yeah, enabled. No, no FOB changes. I don't have prop protection. No, you don't. I advised against it. Hold off. I also wouldn't build that close, Adobe. Not with this server leg, at I'm least. Not, I'm not actually leg. building that close. I'm just sort of lining things up to see what it would look like. The forks are 40 units apart from the center of the props, just like you said. Alright, so this handles your little dual cart business perfectly okay. It has a problem with that van, though. server is actually slowing down. It was fine before you guys got here. My presence kills all servers. I'm trying not to kill my fraps drive. I'm just holding very still so that it records the least amount of information possible. Oh, you fucked it up! Oh. I can't fire the gun fast. So that's probably what it's going to be like. That'll work. That's going to be down lower. It's going to be a big, big one. I have to make mine multi-wheeled. I have to. It's got to turn like a tank, because that makes the most sense. Actually, I wonder if I could have the actual treads move outward and inward for rotating and then stability. That's just a slider and three hydraulics. Slider's working well, actually. Amazingly so. How long was it when you made the slider? A few inches? Uh, I brought the slider from the very top to the very bottom. Hold absolutely still. No, he's going to break it. He's going to break it. It's just another 600. I'm, I'm really down to tough shit. 
So does it does it go off the palette? Does it work on the palette? Oh yeah, it works perfectly under the palette. It actually fits right there into the palette. Is there no fly downward key? I know jump makes you fly up. Why is there no fly down key? No, not even crouch. I'm, I'm so used to Altera's no flip controls. They're better than this. Go this all looks the way perfectly up. stable. Up, 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 up. as far up as it's going to let it go. That's a zero. Oh, you don't. You don't have it pushing from the bottom. You have it pulling up. I have it pulling up. Yeah. I would do top and bottom. I'd have it push and pull. And I've I've done the research, and hi having more than one hydraulic doesn't lag the server at all. Just the controller's legs. I've had like 96 hydraulics on something, and it was perfectly smooth. It's just basically a rendered rope. So you could put like 50 of those in a row and probably destroy the forklift. How you doing, grenade? Adobe. <laughs> you, I just saw you look down at it. You're not centered. I am not centered. Let it down. That's centered. Let me put some weight on that barrel. She wants to go. What does this actually weigh, this van? I didn't weigh it yesterday when I was fucking around with it. Does. It weighs 30 by default, but I can knock it out. Oh, it weighs 30 weight by default? God, I hate that game. Please, please, Gabe Noel, hire me as a consultant. I will come in and I will tell them what is wrong with weapons and vehicles and weight and physics and... How do you design Adobe the source engine's this, physics? Crawl underneath the Adobe. Crawl under there. Oh man, under that's there. all the way up. That's zero. Yeah, you, need, you, could, you could definitely quadruple the, the uh, hydraulics and it'll lift this much faster and it'll probably be... Rape sauce. Good! Good die! Wait, hold it there. Good, good God, it died. Oh, I keep fucking middle clicking for the grenade. It doesn't care. APB? Um, so can, can you restart the server? Yes. Nope. Let me save my little portal. Not our server. Wire. Wire, Helen. Wire. You never really could have. Didn't really know. Ah, I booked a toilet. My smart snap grid is so fine for doing the ETF. I got like a, I don't even know how many squares. Three, six, twelve. I got 144 individual boxes per Phoenix tile. Every grid on the thing is what, 11.863? Or was it 683? I'm not sure. All I know is when I look at this, every square on the texture is 144 squares of snap points. I set my minimum what is this? Right? between snap points to be 5.84 units. I also have my edges set to like 0.00001. Which I never used to it. I was like, why can't I build things properly? Hey, so, um... What's... It's, uh... The base, then... What you want to access to? Uh... Do a test. I'll maybe describe that in words.
Video started. I see Tricky's tutorials has not uh, improved its clientele recently. It's an open server. What can you expect? <laughs> no, he said that. <laughs> what bothers me is that none of the uh, commands seem to be working, and I'm an admin. Which uh, which server? Probably that's it's monkeys. It's literally monkeys. <laughs> throw a banana at him. Find a banana prop and throw it at him. It'd be hilarious. And this will not be racist thing. Oh, that's your stupid thing. Okay. So some of them seem to be working. Down, monkey. Oh, Wait a second. I think he just has the. Uh... Yeah, no, the commands are working. He just doesn't have them uh, saying when they aren't. What do you call it? He has the uh, whisper turned off or something? Uh, I'm admin. Will it kill you anyway? Will Fizz Prop kill you? Ow, it barely let me escape. Adobe! Adobe, get in there! You're not, on, you're not standing on it yet. Not sure if that's gonna kill you. I don't know. I don't, it might end up to be faster for a fizz prop. Although I guess crushing you slowly should kill you. No, because I I died with the uh, with the van being dropped on me. Yeah, but that was a fast hit, which the game I'm sure calculates. This is a slow crushing Necessarily, squeeze. I had it slowly crushed him underneath the fork. Yeah. Hmm. This is still more of a gentle pressure. We'll have to figure it out. Something that wooden that breaks. I don't know. I don't understand why I can't un god myself. Too big. I didn't ask for this. Alright, Kenny. Right, I was working on my uh, hydraulics for turning. Crush, 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 crush. Oh, I need no. fail. Oh, you. Uh, of course, the engine just outputs like spinning forces. You magic spinning forces, right? To the differential. Like, there's nothing actually spinning off the engine. And the differential, like, actually um, simulates a clutch and whatnot. But uh, you could... If I took this barrel, could I attach it to the engine and make it spin? Just straight up? Um, you can attach anything out of a differential to anything. So it can be any problem. Can I attach something spinning into a differential and have it come out at a different speed? I don't think the ACF tool works like that, but you can always uh, request it on the forum, I guess, and they might make it work like that. We've tried, I think. Because we were trying to make a fully E2 uh, transmission at one point. But it involved looking at the... The problem was it involved taking the rotation and the force, and then outputting a ro different rotation at a, diff at a different force, but still having it relate to the original force. So or else you'd have an engine that was idling, and then you could give it massive amounts of resistance, and it wouldn't care because it's all magic spinning at the other end. It would have to somehow say, the car is under load, put the engine under load. That's exactly what ACF is supposed to do. Yes, but it's doing it with a magic engine. I just want a magic transmission. And a magic... Di well, the differentials, we actually got pretty good physical ones now. That, that one with the rope that I completely forget how to do. I'll have to go back and watch my video. Yeah, that one works pretty damn spot on. This transmission still sucked it. Not enough gears of enough sizes or enough meshing. What are you doing with that now? Seeing if this works. Okay. Uh, I guess the sound isn't working for me. 
Oh. No, I'm touching. Enter. And then... Well, I'm revving it up, but it's not spinning unless I have a clutch that's on one of these. There it is. Oh, zero was the clutch. There's supposed to be engine sounds with these things. I think one of them or two of them don't have a sound. Let's see, if I drop the engine speed, it'll speed it down a little slower. Put a plus on it. Oh god, V, you fail. <laughs> v. That's... There's no break. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's <was> awesome. <laughs> I'm just gonna plow it right off of that. I'm busy. I love the sound of these. It's like calming. I want to sleep to this sound. Close your eyes and just... Who are you talking about? Stand inside my spinning truck. Do you hear the thrusters? It's a resonance. I need to uh, figure out some tame this cat. Pretty damn well. I just had to get the transfer case to have the right gear ratios. Jesus, take it up the ramp. Your, I think it'll go your, up the ramp. Um, you're, I think you're, um, maybe colliding on your rear wheels somewhere on the motor or something. There might be some wire stuff. I just don't have a display of what the hell gear... Oh, okay, gear 2 is reverse, so gear 1 is... No, gear 1 is reverse, which means gear 2... Yes, gear 2 is. This is classic video right here. One bad thing is... God, that engine's torquey as shit. <laughs> yeah. Uh, your front wheels are welded together. Actually, can't you use a differential? That makes that help. You need to have a differential. Damn. That worked fine. The transfer case. I had to use a transfer case instead of a differential so I would have a reverse gear. The key pull. And then you put in... A differential in there, then. That's exactly what I did. And plus, uh... Forklifts only have forward and reverse. Yeah, the transfer case only has neutral, forward, and reverse. Thank you.